I will try. I will try to deliver this video to the world. Please do anything, okay? There is no one doing anything about what we are witnessing right now. This is the view from the window I am standing in the front of right now. Since the 24 hours, um, we lost control with the outside world. I am 18 years old girl from Gaza. It does not matter what my name is because every single child in Gaza is living exactly what I am living right now with my family. There is no electricity, there is no internet, there is no water, there is no food, there is no medical supplies in the hospitals. People are dying and no one is seeing this. Today at 8 a.m. I had to leave my house with my family. We tried to do yesterday at 12 uh, a.m. but we couldn't. It was so dangerous to go out but today they started bombing everywhere around us. This hurts. This hurts. You can't, you can't know um, the place that is going to be bombed next. This is like Mentally, we are not okay. Physically, also, we are not okay. Every single child, not only the children, every single person who lives in Gaza has a story. We are not numbers. I have a story. Basically, my home doesn't feel like home anymore. Okay? We are the victims here. We are human beings. We deserve to live. I have lived so many attacks on Gaza and sadly the world is normalizing this like if you are a Gazan you deserve this but no we don't deserve but I have never seen such an aggressive attack like this this one literally there is no safe place like this is the view right now there is my house sadly and i can't know if my house still stands there or not i can't know i am not in my house right now i want to go back to my house safely i want to conto continue living my life what hurts that we don't know what this is going to have an end we want to have an end for what we are living right now they are trying to justify what they are doing in gaza but this this is not true this didn't start at um on the 7th of october this has been going on for the past 75 years they are starting occupying palestine by doing worse than what they are doing right now people literally are dying slowly dying we want a solution for what is going right now i am a child i don't care about politics i don't care about anything in the world i just want to live safely i want to stop feeling afraid of losing one of my family members one of my friends my my house my memories i want this to stop